The stars were out, and that's nothing new in Hollywood, but on this night, they were honoring a man with movie star looks who just happens to be coach the Los Angeles Lakers. You're a Laker fan. You think they can come back and win the championship again this year? No question. No question. With Pat at the helm, there's no doubt about it. I have to thank him for everything, but uh, he is a special person, a special man, as well as a great coach. Most people want to be with the pretty people. He just wants to be needed, and I think he's wonderful. I'm proud to be a part of this. There was a live and silent auction to raise money for MS, a disease that has struck an estimated one quarter of a million Americans. The Riley family, which works year-round for MS, knows the importance of finding a cure. I understand the nature of it, and, uh, you know, uh, MS uh, has always been something that I have been concerned about. It's important to get behind something to heal the physical parts, and, and, and by giving, it, it, it strengthens all of our spirits. And with this kind of energy, I, I believe there's no question there will be a, a cure or answers in the, in the right direction. Of course, the most important aspect of this evening's festivities was to raise money for the Multiple Sclerosis Society. And not only was the society honoring Pat Riley, his team had a little something special in store for their leader. I'm meeting you. Uh, sincerely, I do love you as not only my coach, but my friend. Thank you for teaching me how to wear a double-breasted suit. You know, he's the only white man that uses afro sheen to keep his hair stiff. Thank you for using some of our products, for that. Yes, there was comedy, but there was also inspiration, and that was courtesy of Lola Falana. Two years ago, Falana was struck with MS and was partially paralyzed for almost a year. Now, after a miraculous recovery, she's back delighting her fans. It's difficult for me to go visit the people that had MS and to have come through it like this and can't bring them with me. I feel bad inside. I want to do something. And I'm glad that so many other people want to, especially Pat Riley. In accepting the Coach of the Decade Award, Riley not only reflected on Falana's comeback, he also had something very special to say to those now suffering with MS. Give them one thing, telling them that no matter what they do all day, all day, all night, that they're special, that they were born of special stuff. To tell them to thank God for their special gifts.